Hey, what's up guys? Thank you for tuning into my channel. Today I wanted to come and film a tutorial on this subtle, natural ombre lip that I've been rocking. So if you are interested in how I achieve this look, then stay tuned. Okay guys, so the first thing I'm going to do is conceal my lips and I'm going to use the Maybelline Cover Stick in the color Deep Beige and this is going to help the ombre really pop it's going to mute out the natural color of my lips so you just want to go ahead and apply that evenly um, over your lips ah i know it looks scary but trust me it's going to help the ombre um, really pop and the first thing you want to do is get a nude that matches your skin tone um, and i'm going to be using wet n wilds barely legal and i'm not going to be using lip liner for this look so you want a nude that's really going to match your skin tone because we want a nice soft feathered out look and i'm just going to go ahead and apply the barely legal to my lips and as you can see it's pretty spot on it matches my skin tone perfectly and I'm just gonna zoom in here a little bit now the next thing you want to do is get your orange lipstick of your choice um, and we're going to be applying that to the insides of our lips and I'm going to be using my favorite orange lippy which is the salmon matte by Brucci and this is just a generic beauty supply store brand lipstick you know $1.99 but um, of course you can use whatever orange lipstick you choose so I'm going to go ahead and apply that to the inside of my lip to get the ombre started. And I really like this color combination. It's really subtle. It's natural, but it's unexpected at the same time. And I just liked it because it was just so different. So you're going to go ahead and apply that to the insides of your lips and just press your lips together. Um, I would advise pressing your lips together versus rubbing them together because you don't want this look to become a whole muddy mess on your on your mouth you want to really be able to control how the colors blend so just continue to apply the lipstick I'm gonna go ahead after this and apply some more of the the, uh, the neutral because I want to um, you know really have a separation of the colors from the outside going to the inside And this is just um, really soft, really natural, but it's unexpected, like I said. It's different, and I just really, really like it. And I think it's uh, a perfect look for fall. And that's it, guys. That is the complete look. Simple, easy, unexpected, and different. And here are a couple of close-ups. So if you haven't done so already, be sure to head over to my style blog and check me out, styleisle.com. And I will post a few pictures um, at the end of the video. That's it, guys. Ciao for now.